A biomedical engineer is a person who develops technology that helps save lives. They apply knowledge of engineering, biology, and biomechanical principles to design, develop, and evaluate biological products such as artificial organs, prosthetics, medical information systems, and health management. Biomedical engineers use STEM principles every day to achieve tasks. STEM is curricular based on the idea of educating students in four specific disciplines science, technology, engineering, and math in an interdisciplinary approach. Biomedical engineers have to have good critical thinking skills. Critical thinking is a way of thinking about a subject, content, or problem. The thinker improves the quality of his or her thinking by skillfully analyzing, assessing, and reconstructing their thoughts. Critical thinking results in better communication and problem-solving abilities, and a commitment to overcome egocentrism and sociocentrism. The field of biomedical engineering can be broken down even further. Some examples include bioinstrumentation in which scientists use electronics, computer science, and measurement principles to develop devices that are used in diagnosis and treatment of diseases. Biomaterials is the study of naturally occurring or laboratory designed materials that are used in medical devices or implantation materials. Biomechanics involves the study of mechanics such as thermodynamics to solve biological or medical problems. Clinical engineering applies medical technology to optimize healthcare delivery. Rehabilitation engineering is the study of engineering and computer science to develop devices that assist individuals with physical and cognitive impairments. Systems physiology uses engineering tools to understand how systems within living organisms, from bacteria to humans, function and respond to changes in their environment. So how do you become a biomedical engineer? It is usually required for biomedical engineers to have a bachelor's degree in biomedical engineering or bioengineering from accredited program. It is also possible to have a bachelor's degree in another type of engineering and choose either a biological science elective or a graduate degree in biomedical engineering. Combining two sciences such as medicine and engineering is proving to be the solution to a variety of problems. Not only is biomedical engineering extended life expectancy, but improving the quality of life for billions as well. By applying skills such as critical thinking, engineers are able to save and improve lives. Engineers are people who take an idea and make it into a real revolutionary creation.